So a video update to the um, commodity buying and selling video I made not too long ago, about two months ago maybe. Um, and you can see that this is the after. Basically I bought lots of gems, let's see down here, rubies, and they were only, you know, a thousand to twelve hundred gold apiece. And I kind of set my upper limit at twelve hundred. And I said over time I expected the prices to go up, and as you can see, right now they have they're about 2600 so I bought these for a thousand gold but it took you know, this is on the 16th and the 15th and really I started buying on like the 10th and you know as prices stay down I kept buying until I filled up my inventory and now I've started to unload them and you can see prices have been going up and uh, you can see this is a really nice way to make good gold I bought this for 19,000 and this is an 18,000 set it's gonna sell for 47,000 gold and or 47 million gold I paid you know 19 to 20 million even after fees I'm gonna about double my gold and the reason I like this more than any other strategy is because I don't have to hunt for items to flip I don't really have to do anything really I just buy and hold and it takes you know one second to buy a big set of gems and it takes a minute to unload each stack it's just much smoother than really any other strategy. The only thing is you have to wait. I haven't been playing much Diablo 3 lately. I've been mostly focusing on StarCraft 2 and just doing a lot of writing. So this is like rather than let my gold just sit here and do nothing, this is a good strategy to use. And you need to make you need to have a lot of gold to make it worthwhile. I mean if you only have twenty million gold, you're best off making a gem because even if you double your 20 million gold to 40 million gold, if it took you a month to do it, not so much. Now, if you buy a billion gold in gems and turn it into 2 billion gold, and all it takes you is the 30 minutes to buy the gold, uh, 20 minutes really to buy the gems initially in the hour or so to sell them. I mean, a billion gold an hour, you're going to be tough. You're going to have a uh, a tough time with that. And one thing I like to do is to not flood the market, but to not also undersell myself and you can see this under 18,000 I only paid 17 million for and I'm gonna to try to sell it I'm just gonna keep bumping this price up by a hundred and the reason this works is this only works with this lag if the stack sizes are exact so that was my last big stack alright there's a stack okay and this way you don't get completely uh you know, undersold. And like I did that yesterday, and you can see each stack gave me a little bit more gold because prices went up a little bit faster than I thought they were going to. But, um, so yeah, that's how it's done. And I hope this video helped you. Just giving you an update to let you know that it does work. It just takes some time, you know. I was patient. I bought in the middle of July, selling in the middle of August, and I'm, you know, made a billion gold doing it. And that way, when the next patch comes out, they finally put in PvP. I'll have a lot of gold and a nice gear set just to roll into the new content. And this barely takes up any of my time, and I'll be ready to go when the next expansion comes out. So that's it for this video, and I hope it was beneficial for you. Give it a try. It definitely works. It just, you just have to be patient.